really it was as an adult that I remember. Like how old is she? I, like I would think yes. I think they, I wasn't really even in my 20s, I wasn't that aware of the, the, the whole Damar because they didn't talk about it. My mother didn't talk about it until I was much older, probably in my 30s, 40s maybe even. Um, and then they would have the, you know, they would celebrate, like have, a, um, you know, gatherings and, and, and talk about it um, later. But my mother would tell me the story of her father who got very weak during this year of famine. It was a dreadful famine and he became quite ill. So if there was food, he'd make sure the children would get it first and the, his wife. And he would take very little for himself. He became very weak until he was just bedridden and Mama was beside him. And they had a, a little orchard. So they had a pear tree, they had cherry tree, they had apple tree. And towards spring, um, my mother, Mama would say her father, as he was about to die, and she didn't know, and he called her like, and, and he said, Ola, Go to the go to the the orchard and get me a pear from the tree. And she said, you know, Tato, there are no leaves on the tree. It's still you know it's still very early spring, and he just passed away <clears throat> in that moment. Yeah. So. Pears are very sort of. My mama was very connected to pears, and um, I brought like there's a green pear, and then there's a little pear here that's um, when she was in the um, uh, retirement home in Toronto, um, is uh, St. Peter and Paul's residence. Um, there was many pear trees that they had planted in in the in the garden, and so these little pears, like they were just little ones, right? They never grew very big, and they were really hard and green. Mm -hmm. And Mama loved when I would pick the pear and I would, would let her hold it and then she would love this, these little pears. And um, so I gave her a little pear and she put it in her pocket and forgot about it. And a few years later when she passed away this jacket, um, I kept it because it was good for shoveling snow, it was really light. So I reached in and I pulled out something like, what is this? And it was like, oh, it's Mama's Hrushka. And it's completely like um, petrified. petrified yeah. And I could, didn't have the heart to throw it out, right? Because pears are very, um, you know, I'm very connected to somehow to, to the pear, the beautiful pear. The full-figured pear. 